So a number of years ago, we had a meeting with Cesar and Joanna McDowell, and they introduced Scope into us as a as a really uh, powerful methodology, research methodology, and the the full executor was was introduced to it, and that's how we heard about it. And yeah, I mean, I think the what we saw was very very impressive, very thorough, very rigorous, and we were convinced to to actually subscribe to the, I think it was the 2016 server. Uh, absolutely. Uh, if it hadn't, we wouldn't continue to use it or um, subscribe to it every year. And so yes, it has. How? It's guided a lot of our strategies. So we actually, in our business planning sessions, in our, our forward planning thinking, we bring a lot of that information into the conversations, into the planning, and you know where there's areas we want to focus on, and we're seeing gaps in what the research is showing. We put plans in place to close those gaps. So, we we absolutely um, you know have see see benefit in it, and we absolutely use that information to to give us guidance. And then what we also do is we use that information to to assess on if we have achieved or we want to achieve in that cycle. So absolutely we, we learned definitely things that we weren't aware of about our agency. Um, you know, we had made certain assumptions that we were maybe perceived in a certain way or we were positioned in a certain way and you know information came back that that was not in a line to what we, we thought. So we absolutely learned things that we didn't um, know. We also learned things that were different to what we perceived. And, um, and obviously because it's such a thorough, you know, such thorough research that you get, you, you listen really hard to it because it's you, you're getting feedback from sort of the top 200 marketers. So I think it would be, wouldn't be very wise to ignore that information but absolutely there was things that came out that we uh, were, were kind of new to us. Absolutely on that one we you know in our business there's a lot of you know perceptions and a lot of different views that we have as executives and you know from the markets but I think when you sit down and you do your business planning you actually want quite reliable data to, to base your decisions on and I think that's what's powerful about scope and it really gives you, you know, it's, 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 it's pretty much deep and it's pretty wide in terms of covering a number of different uh, aspects of our industry and then it's quite thorough in understanding, you know, where we sit or, you know, how the industry is, is positioned in those areas so that's we absolutely use that information to guide our business planning, guide, guide our long-term thinking, and as I mentioned earlier, we then also use it to, to check at the end of our sort of cycles if we are uh, on track to those, to that, to those sort of the, the strategy we've planned. So, the results are sometimes quite sobering in terms of seeing the facts, but I think the benefit is once you've seen the facts and you know where you stand as an agency, uh, you can do something about it. So, what I've actually probably mentioned already is a lot of the information we get then helps guide our business plan and our thinking, but really I think the benefit is you see, you see the facts in black and white, and it's in front of you and then you can use that information to, to make a change and to assist to move in the direction you want to move to.